right, um, just real quick, uh, if you're looking for a particular sound effect and you can't find it, um, my best recommendation is what I like to call the Google of sound, findsounds.com. So let's say I'm looking for something, I have a collection of sounds, but I can't find that particular sound. Um, I'm going to look for a punch sound. And I start looking, and there's one. Now let's see if I can hear it. Okay, I can listen to it. Yeah, that's all right. Now let's go back to find a better one. Okay, that sounds cool. So if I find a sound I like, um, I'm going to put my uh, my mouse so it turns into a little finger hand, and I'm going to right click and save link as or download sound or whatever. The option when I when I look at it, I should be looking at a it should say a wave sound, an MP3 or maybe uh, an AFIF, or whatever the, the um, there's a Mac format. So I'm going to save it. I might want to change the name if I like the name. I'm going to try to pay attention to where I'm saving it. I'm just going to keep it in my downloads. Um, you can save it to a folder so that you have your sound effects. In a certain fact, I might make a folder and call it um, maybe fight sound effects. So if I'm going to have a, a stick figure fight here. So I'm going to open that up. Oops, where is that? Oh, there it is. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna go into that folder and I'm gonna save my sound effect. Bam. Okay, now I can add that sound to my project. I can just click the arrow, show in folder. There's my folder and there's my sound. I can drag that into my program. Uh, Movie Maker, Final Cut. Uh, in this case, we're working with Clipchamp. So uh, anyway, there is a quick how to do it.